move to station number two. This is really designed to help you move up and down and control a landing. Footwork is important in a golf swing as well as balance. Okay, so we're going to start here Jack and we're going to take hops over each cone and we're going to hold that landing. Land it, hold it and then spring again. It's great in the golf swing if young players can establish sort of an upward propulsion, an upward movement, create some force from the ground upwards. A lot of your work in golf comes through your footwork and it's really important at a young age we can establish this. So let's go Jack, see what you can do. Good, hold that landing. It's not about speed, it's about control. Good. Good, keep the feet a bit more together. Great landing, well done, over the last one. And then when he turns around and comes back, we're gonna create a flow to this. So he's gonna come back and he's not gonna stop. So he's got the control, now he's trying to get the control and the speed. Something that we need in a golf swing, and something we're gonna look at in the later tips. Okay, when he lands, I want both feet to land at the same time. Control that landing and then come back and I want again two feet to land and we're going to do this for two minutes. See if you can keep a straight line in between the cones. See a lot of youngsters wandering left and right because they can't control the balance in the body. It's important in your golf swing that you've got balance. You know you think about Tiger Woods and those guys they create 130 mile an hour club head speed with a driver but they still maintain great balance. <laughs> 